Welcome, Bwana Waziri. Thank you. Please. And who is this charming young lady with you? Oh, she's from, uh, and she is the lady with our plan. Good morning, sir. What could possibly have possessed you to bring your bedroom pet into such serious issues? Gentlemen, please. I have dealt with them with before. But you, Bwana Waziri, you take idiots into a whole new level. Gentlemen. If there's any chance of this plan actually succeeding, it must involve her. I give you my word on this. Your word? Your word? <laughs> and what? Oh my God. You're serious? This is not an act. You're really that stupid. Please. All right. We'll give you a hearing. If I don't like it, well, it will be out of my hands. <laughs> Answering such questions should not bother you at all. Timak, you're needed at the principal's office now. on our side, plus all the relevant committees. The product is substandard, and we need the MPs to turn a blind eye. And that requires money. I believe that through intensive lobbying, we can get the majority in Parliament to push through, to, to push through amendments that are key to the smooth introduction of blood boost to the market. The Ministry of Standards is also key to the deal because we need an analyst who can clear it without raising too many questions. The MPs can then be lobbied into a retreat and then we can rest assured that they will tow our line. It's actually a good school. <laughs> Thank you. I hope she's happy. She is. She is, yeah. yeah. Oh, here she comes. Hi, Timak. What is it, Mom? And what is he doing here? Timak, I need to talk to you about something. <laughs> Please don't tell me that you want us to be one big family this stranger. Show some respect. Tell me. Timak. We've been kicked out of the house. What do you mean, kicked out? It seems like your father was unable to meet his financial obligations. So the auctioneers came in to repossess the house and everything in it. Are you telling me that what I call home is no more? I'm sorry, Timak. I'm sorry. Look what you've done. If you hadn't brought that guy home, this wouldn't have happened. Please, just go to dad and tell him that you're sorry. Tumak, your dad and I are over. Okay? <laughs> Someday you'll understand. I hate you, mom. You ruined my life and I hate you for this. Look, if you want to disrespect me, go right ahead. But you should not speak to your mom like that. You're not my father, so let me go. Tim has been so kind enough to, to let us stay in his house. I'm not moving in with that guy. Relax, Tim Mark, okay? We're not going to stay together. He's given us his spare house. They're just going to leave me and you, okay? Okay? challenging part 
will be to pay all those involved without causing waves. I have a plan where everyone involved will be paid and not even the anti-corruption crusaders will suspect a thing. We have identified a charity trust. Everyone involved will be made trustees. Do you understand the law that govern the setting up and running of trust fund? Yes, sir, I do. And I have already identified one that we can do business with. And they have agreed to let our people be made the trustees. Are you sure the anti-corruption won't follow the trail? Yes, that is as far as the trail can lead them, sir. Omega Energy will organize a promotion with a cash prize of 10 million, Bambua Mitakumi. The common Wananchi will win caps, umbrellas. A few will win 10,000 shillings. I will win the grand prize. How will you win the grand prize if there's so many other eager participants? I have a guy at the gaming controls board. Oh. The whole thing will be staged. That sounds interesting. Go on. The winner will get 5 million cash prize and another 5 million to a charity organization of his choice. Mozambo will pocket the cash prize that will be deposited in the trust and the rest will be disbursed to the trustees. And that, gentlemen, is my plan. <sighs> Give me time to think. Suleiman? Relax, Velma. Everything will be fine. Sit, you two. Your plan has some loopholes, and it could easily fail. Besides, you know too much. I'm sorry. <laughs> 